Smith breeze blowing uh, down the pitch at the moment. Drillich gets the shot in, is pushed round the post by Hyderi. Just very well indeed. Drillich first to react. And there's a goal. Drillich celebrates. And is that the goal that takes Australia into the semi finals of this FIFA Beach Soccer World Cup 2013 qualifier? Let's have a look at the goal from Drillich. How on earth do you score from that angle? Absolutely remarkable. Just curling it in, the goalkeeper had left his near post. And that is just about as special as you get. He got up his sleeve. It's a shot in, powerfully beaten away. Well, the Afghan fans enjoyed that save. And surely this now is Australia's victory. Drillich, can he put the icing on the cake? Yes, he can. Good body strength, good persistence, got round the keeper and the easiest tap in in the end. So David Drillich, the veteran striker, Pani Nikas, finds Drillich who's on the sand, has a shot. Drillich who didn't appear at all in the first period, he's come onto the sand and straight away made an impact. Getting the shot in, it was parried by Jamal Abu Haddad. But he could do nothing more than parry it. And the ball on the line and rammed home from point blank range in emphatic fashion by Nikas. In fact, it may even have crossed the line. Drillich gets the shot in off the underside of the bar. Then that wonderful shot. Where did the power come from there? There was virtually no backlift at all. Gianni again given space and again given the opportunity to shoot Drillich on the turn scores. They gave Patriciani far too much time and Drillich brought the ball under control. Drillich's second goal of the tournament to go with the one he scored on day one against Oman. What a good strike that was from Drillich from close range. Gravani it was and look who set it up. Drillich turning the ball goalwards. Now it's Drillich, David Drillich, who's had such a, an important impact in this match, didn't uh, appear in the first period. And after he came on, Australia looked a transformed side. Tons of experience in the 11 a side game. This is pressure of a different sort. How's he going to cope with it? Copes well by putting the ball into the back of the net. 2 1. Lived up to his name. Drillich drilled the ball in there powerfully with his right foot. Tomorrow in the third and fourth place playoff. And only one of those sides rolled forward. Stella off the post again. Drillich this time. La Stella setting you up. This is unbelievable. You really couldn't make it up. I think that's six times now. Great header from Drillich. Real athleticism. Leaning back, twisting his body. Back post, Drillich with the header, good save. Adari did well there, pushing it away with his left hand. David Strill, it's the dual Socceroo. Beach Socceroos going through to Strillage. Of course, he's the only man to score for Australia in two different forms of football. Quick with your reflexes as a beach so soccer goalkeeper. And David Strillage, he uses his body so well near the goal. 2014 Australian Beach Soccer Cup encounter, and it's a brilliant move. Cravani almost finishes it off. Strillage with the follow up effort. At this point, yeah, see, that's what we're talking about. The men coming through while the wall's set up, it pops over. And, uh, Brilliant move by the beach socceroos. 
And here comes David Strillich. Loves to turn his man and then shoot on the angle. He's almost lost the ball in the sand, still gets the shot away. Uh, often there's a lot of space in there, and here's Rillo with it at his feet again. He loves those positions and uh, to use his, his body in the best way, doesn't he? He does. That's his first goal for this particular tournament. Uh, and in previous tournaments, has got highest goal scorer in the last, I think, four tournaments, Vitor. Um, so hopefully that opens up the floodgates just there. Brilliant. Loves nothing more than hitting the back of the net on the Vanuatu yeah. have done well to keep him quiet for most of the encounter in those situations. Yeah. But they can't stop him there. It's really David Strelich with the goal for Australia. Almost identical from uh, Vanuatu's goal earlier on. Back post throw. Yeah. Brilliant, Zrilla. Fantastic. Lost his marker. He was a predator in the box for the Socceroos. And he's exactly the same for the beach Socceroos. Australia 6, Vanuatu 4. There's Carl Tack. Direct ball to Strillage off the post. How many times have Australia hit the frame of the goal? It's really a little fantastic throw by Tommy just there. Almost getting himself into trouble, but finds Danaskis. Again, looking for that bicycle. Oh, Strillage is there! It's paid off for him that time. I'm not sure if Strillage gets the flick on here. I think he does in that last minute. Gets in front of the goalkeeper. Excellent. Extremely well done by David Zrilich to block the view there. And a little flick. He did ever so well to just take it beyond the goalkeeper's reach and pull Australia level. Danaska set it up. Zrilla finishes it. Great vision from Zrilla here. You can see the man tracking through. Danaska comes through. Finishes off with his right foot. Basically rugby tackling Zrilich. Just tackling him off the ball. Now he has the chance to put Australia in front from a set piece. And he's done so brilliant from David Strillich and Australia lead for the first time in the final. Strillich doesn't miss many from there. Along the ground, exceptionally hard for the goalkeeper. Clinical. He has put the beach Socceroos in front, leading from the front, David Strillich. There's a big crowd at North Beach in Wollongong. Witnessing a fine spectacle. Strillich, oh, brilliantly saved. Good Jim Wong. The boys need something here, not long to go. That's where Striller loves to work his magic. Turn his man and strike from an angle. Loves playing it on the deck as well, I must say. He's brilliant with the ball at his feet.